Hello and welcome once again to Machinky. So in this episode, I want to do a couple of the quests that I've got. One in particular is just politics. So I've got to connect Reading, uh, which is this city just here, with Hull, all the way down here. And I want to do this because, hey, more cities I add, more money I earn, so it's worth it. So you can go just there. You can head up from there and you can come down there. And I would have put it right in the line of that, wouldn't I? Damn you. Okay. I think if we add a curve there, no, further back than that, curve there. coming off and a switch going on. Damn it. Uh, although I don't have to remove the whole thing, I just have to remove that curve. That's better. Right, so you go to there, you go to there. Perfect. Did that go all the way down? Yes, it did. Perfect. Okay, so now we just need 200 passengers to be delivered from both. So let's get a train. I mean, I could use you. Mm. I'm going to go with you. A couple of first classes, a second class, and a dining car. That's a little bit too long, but I'm going to go with it anyway. So you want to go from there to there. And speed up time so the train actually leaves. There we go. So it can't carry too many passengers, but it'll give decent money because both first class and the uh, dining car add extra money. Wow, so many people there. I'm sorry if you can hear our puppy barking in the background. Um, he's sort of learning where his voice is at the moment. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah, so that will add a little bit of extra money coming in. I'm doing all right on money, actually. Now, next thing I really want to add is more wood, because we're not doing too good there, are we? For that, we could just add build some extensions to this. Why have you shrunk again? Yeah, bigger. Mm. 
There we go. Massive forest. And if I just get a couple of extra trains going there. So we finished the reward for that. Uh, yeah, except. And we're already delivering lots of passengers there, so that's fine. And, ooh, collect the reward for that. Awesome. Yeah, so with more wood being produced there, I now need more wood production at this place. Add that later if I get enough steel. Right. Now I need some more trains actually getting that wood and delivering it. Do I want you or do I want those? I mean, the little trains can pull a lot, and at 31 mile an hour, they're not going to be that much slower than what's currently running around that loop. Although you're on that loop and you're a faster train. Yeah, let's just upgrade to these. I, I am definitely going to have to upgrade my coal, though, if I have too many of these. So we'll have two of them at first. And I've just run out of wood, so I can't keep buying those. Damn it! Too many. Two more. Yeah, perfect. Okay, so you want to go from that station. Actually, no, it's better to start at this station, at least then they'll be going in the right direction. So both of you start there then go to there. Perfect. Damn it, we've run out of wood so we can't keep buying them. That sucks a little. You move 49 wood and you move 46. You actually move less than that one. Wow. Okay. At most, this station will be able to be three wide. Eek. That's pretty small, actually. Well, I say that, I could make it bigger. It's really backed myself into a corner the way I've built this, haven't I? Oh well, I'll have to worry about that later. We have enough wood. Right, so buy one of you. Okay, nope. And you want to go... From there, all right, the same as that train. Go. Now, thankfully, oh no, I can't because of the oh, damn you. All right, you know what? That's gone. That house is gone. Let's turn the waiting room that way. Now I can put another station there. And you need to be removed and a signal like that. Perfect. Ooh, 
Although trains are backing up here a little bit, which isn't good. Okay, let's extend that a bit. So that I can remove that, just to give me some more sort of wiggle room where I'm putting stuff. Same with down here, let's add in a new piece there that then connects to there. Then I can remove that bit. Just finish that. Going poster will finish instantly, pretty much. To be honest, I could remove that as well now, because the trains can still make their loop as they were. That gives me a little bit more space around here. See, going postal, finished almost instantly. So if we add another station there. So like this, only the first two stations can loop. So then we'll need to add a new loop there instead. And that works. Okay. So, Massive Station now covers it completely. Now, let's add another station there. doesn't slow them down as much now. That works. I could start delivering extra wood from say here, but for the moment it doesn't look like I need to. build some extra stuff onto this coal mine, just so this train is shifting a little bit more coal at once, because coal we have 
like none of. I know I've tilted that very far in Cole's favour, so let's add that at minimum down there on the iron. Yeah, wow, that's going to fill up the drain now, so that station's just going to overflow. That's probably not a bad thing, though. It will help get iron in a bit quicker, and it will hopefully help me get some coal tokens in a bit quicker, because we are running low on those now. Tell you what. That's why I'm running low, because that cost 80 of them. I could set a second train running that loop. Then again, I could grab a new loop. Like a new one just here to get that coal. I'm a little worried about my coal. It is pretty low. Yeah, that's just dropping constantly, isn't it? Okay, so I'm going to need at least one more train grabbing coal for me to feel happy or comfortable. So let's add a new station in there. this right from there say no nope that's right I knew I'd get it eventually So to get onto the line, it goes that way. To get off of the line, and to be honest, it can just go straight back in like that. Yeah, that'll work. Right. So, say we're going... We go there. Then if I decide to, I can add on a station to collect wood as well. Like a, all I've got to do is extend the station. And then I can collect wood from there. If I decide there's a need to. Same as if I extend it by one. Then if I decide to, I can put a station in there and it can collect coal, oh, it can collect iron ore as well. Right. See, planning for the future as well as the moment. train that uses coal but then all of the ones that don't use coal are so slow all right you and I will just hope that you collect enough coal that it doesn't matter that'll be the 
most it can carry. So you go there, you go there, then you go there. Begin. So I can carry 54 at max. Definitely want to increase this, don't I? Is there a lumber yard anywhere near here? No. That's why I didn't really need the wood, isn't it? Yeah. Which is a shame. But I think that is where we are going to end this episode, guys. So hopefully you've enjoyed the slightly randomness of this episode. I'm just trying to do lots of little things. Thankfully we are making a lot of um, cash coins at the moment. So I want to sort of increase the number of coins that we're making in general so that we have a large stockpile. But uh, thank you for watching guys. Please like, comment and subscribe and I shall see you next time.